All right, well, this is an example of how it is that you can jumpstart your Dagu iRacer from SparkFun. I bought one of these a few months back, had a great time playing around with it, uh, but then after it sat in the box for a little bit, it wouldn't recharge. Uh, I contacted tech support and they suggested that I jumpstart it by basically applying five volts uh, to the battery terminals. And on mine, uh, they're actually right down here. There's a positive and a negative. There's actually two pair of them, uh, but you'll notice that one of them is actually soldered to. And if you were to take this board off and look underneath it, you'd see that that's where the battery was attached. So for me, I basically just want to apply five volts to these connectors right here, uh, positive and negative. Now to do that, I basically went and got just an old, you know, phone charger uh, and clipped the end off of it. Uh, right here, you can see the the loose leads, and just hooked it up to a multimeter so I could figure out which lead was positive and negative. And I want to make sure that I'm getting five volts out of this. Uh, if you read the instructions on the Dagu I racer, it says make sure not to apply more than six volts uh, to the power uh, leads. So basically, if I take that and plug this in, I got a little power strip over here. <coughs> make sure to keep my tips apart. I ought to be able to now then apply positive and negative. Oh, I want to make sure that I have this turned on. So I'll turn the car on. And then I can apply positive and negative. One, two, three, four, five. Take it off. Try it again. One, two, three, four, five. And you can see the lights have now come on. And I've sort of jump started this thing. Now I can take my regular charger. I'll plug that into a little power out. It's just a USB cable. Plugged in there. And now I can take this and plug the charger in normally. And I should be able to see uh, these yellow lights here, uh, or green lights as you will, uh, start to go up as the charge level increases. So I can now get my Dagu iRacer recharging. And that's how you jumpstart a dead Dagu iRacer.